trying to accomplish one thing. One thing. That is to get to the future. Dan get any sleep? No. 
but thank you for asking. It's great to see Up so many next. absolute champions in the chat there. Rose Far Brother, former Eve Tech Rose Far Brother, I should say, sent Rose some love. Uh, Lee Ingster, thank you for being here. Greg Willage, of course. Champagne Sumo. Always great to have you here, my friend. The man, the myth, the legend who always lives up to their name. The person whose name I have never been able to pronounce, Sergio. Hey, Making our way to the ring. In the Eve Top 15, she is Iron World, Alex Wayne. Number seven in the Eve Top 15 gets Tai Honma. Tai Honma opened up last night, and she was victorious against Rachel Armstrong. Is the uh, opening position a lucky spot for Taye? Would it be two times? <laughs> Alex Windsor, Taye Honma, Taye Honma. Successful last night. Those will make it two in a row. Alex Windsor didn't get to wrestle last night because of the attack from Charlie Morgan, two best friends who, quite frankly, I'm kind of sick of all this because it's gone on for over a year now of interrupting and getting involved in each other's matches. <laughs> Solid bell ring in there. <laughs> Sir Knight 1399, great to see you here, the old librarian. Sir Knight saying glad Alex is okay, me too. She was attacked from behind, run face first into that post and beaten, beaten to a pulp, pretty much. Ty Honma trying to keep hold of Alex Windsor and Alex Windsor was trying to get her away. Alex Windsor quickly learning that Ty has got the speed advantage here. Cheeky Tai Hanma. Oh, Tai Hanma sent so hard into that top corner that she actually went face first into the middle. Going up to the second rope. <laughs> How you doing, Amira? Say hello to everyone. Hello, everyone. I'm so sorry. I'm so <laughs> no, big drop kick there from Tai Hanma. Just a one count, Alex Windsor, ranked number seven, former pro wrestling champion, a former Tokyo Joshi Pro Wrestling International Champion. And Alex Windsor won that championship, of course, from Jetta, the wife of her now former best friend, Charlie Morgan. And in many ways, that was the start of this breakup between the two that has resulted in over a year of back and forth interruptions, attacking one another, trying to make up with one another, that not happening, falling apart. It has been a messy, messy year and a half for Alex Windsor and Charlie Morgan. And I am just hoping, beautiful neck breaker there, using the ring to her advantage is Alex Windsor. Goes for the cover. You see how she puts the forearm there across the shoulder as well as hook the leg. Alex Windsor knows what it takes to beat someone the caliber of Tai Hanma. Hells, thanks so much for joining us. Great to see you, you absolute champion. And all the people, oh, nice cradle. That was close. That was a great hook there. Nice Oklahoma roll. Wasn't able to get that other shoulder. Great find though to hold it down. We are here live. At the Big Penny, there's over 400 fans have joined us. Don't ask me for the exact amount. I don't know. They just said to me, well, we're past 400 now. I was like, okay, cool. Nice DDT. Alex Windsor dropped right on the top of her head. She might be out again. And this is actually a thing because of the fact that she was ran face first and head first, really, into that steel post last night and attacked by Charlie Morgan. You know, as much as she's coming in and showing us that she is, you know, with it, I think the fact that when you get dropped on your head, the way that Ty Hunma dropped Alex Windsor on her head with that DDT, we can kind of see that that's just not a normal DDT here. Oh my goodness, Lord! But I think maybe she just pissed Alex Windsor off because that was some force there. And there's the 
the sharpshooter, the very move that Alex Winter used to win the Pro Wrestling Championship at Wrestle Kingdom 5 from Jetta. Every now and then you'll see, as you can see on the screen, just then as Ty Honda makes the ropes. This is a 15 minute time of the map. There is still just over 11 minutes. We're almost four minutes into this match. And Ty Honda early on finding herself in that sharpshooter. Nice drop kick there, right to the shoulder of two. Oh, and to the, uh, into the collarbone. Oh, Ty Honda moves out of the way and Alex Winter was looking at the crowd. Ty Honda just feeling it there. Yeah, it was right on a collarbone. You see, you keep going to that right there. Great. Again, a big welcome to everyone in the chat. Remember, if you want to watch the entire show, you need to hit that join button. And you become a member on any single EVE Live Plus tier. If you want to be, if you just want to support us, you're not in a position to be able to where you can watch the full shows in the back catalog. That's fine. We appreciate any kind of support. That's what the enhancement talent there is for. You literally enhance us. You literally are able to give us that little kick up. And the, the roster and everyone involved in EVE greatly appreciate it. We all greatly appreciate all the more members, don't we? Oh, I do. I love members. That means more money for me. I'm only joking. And, and also more people watching and attention on you. Oh, you, you, you know, you yes, know. all those things. But I always try and grab the attention anyway, don't I? Don't you, you do. You do indeed. <laughs> Alex Winter challenging Ty Honda. Oh, Ty Honda delivers. Alex Winter delivers back. These two firing up. You hear this crowd, 400 plus strong here. But Mitchell saying, I'm so sad on the next night. I wish you were here as well, my friends. Wrestling Nutshell, thanks so much for joining us. As Wrestling Nutshell says, if you join now, you'll get the Eve April 5th show in there as well, which will be live. Oh, nice headbutt there again, right to the chest and the collarbone, I think, caught there as well. Oh, rolling through again, going for that. Oh, look at the strength of Alex Windsor. Ty Honda just firing up. Blue Thunder, nice counter. Very close there. What a show we got coming up. I mean, hell of a look. We have our first code breaker of the night. Double knees right into the jaw of Alex Windsor. Referee checking on Alex Windsor, making sure that they want to continue. Seven minutes almost gone in this match, and it's been a frantic pace between these first time ever competitors opposite one another. You can see it. Crowd is split. Number of the fans for Alex Windsor, number of fans for Tai Honma. See the crowd getting behind Tai Honma as she pulls herself up to the top rope. Alex Windsor, desperation, runs after. She doesn't want to allow Tai Honma to come off that top rope with any kind of attack. Uh, Tai Honma almost falling off backwards there. She fires herself back. Nice right cross there. And for those, is the man, the myth, the legend says, if you just joined us, hit that like button and hit that subscribe. Never miss an stream. Oh, the top rope! The drop kicks have gotten bigger, and every time she's come closer, one, two, Windsor. Yeah, and a look on Windsor's face tells you what she felt and had to go through to kick out of that one. Honma pulling her up, going for that waist lock there. What's she signal for? Break set. Champagne Sumo, thank you so much. In payment for the code breaker fight, and oh, she couldn't keep hold of the grip. And then, Known to many Western wrestling fans as the Disarmer. It is a, um, oh, oh, no, no, no. Alex manages to separate. Again, a big thank you to Champagne Sumo for the 999 Super Chat. Says payment for the code breaker fine. How many, oh! 
Teardrop Suplex. What a counter. One, two, and no. And for those who don't know, oh, knee to the jaw. One, two, and no. Oh, that was. That was, wasn't it? That was. Again, for those of you unaware, anyone that super chats becomes a channel member, what is it that you're funding there? What it is is that you're funding us to be able to make more shows like this, where we bring in stars from around the wrestling world, not just local. Eva's not a local promotion. Eva's a global promotion. Wrestling stars from around the world, and we can create more content, more shows, create more opportunities. Every single piece of income that you guys give goes straight back into these shows and the talent. Oh, my Lord. So you guys are literally funding more shows. You literally are creating more opportunities. You literally are making shows. Oh, another DDT. This time, this could be it. Top of the head. One, two, and oh. That was, yeah, I can understand why Taye was a little, was a little on that because that was a long two to three. Again, if you haven't already done so, make sure you hit that like button. Remember, the first half of this show is completely free. As you see on the screen there, remember to like and subscribe. Oh, backslide attempt from Taye to and oh! Ooh, ooh, ooh. I Dead. She won the TWEW International Championship with that. She gets it. The winner of this match, Alex Winter. There we go. Now, as much as I do not want to take away from the fantastic match I've just had, there is one thing and one thing only that is bugging me tonight more than fucking anything. Charlie Morgan. You have fucked me over for the last time. You better watch your back because tonight I am fucking coming for you. Charlie Morgan attacked Alex Windsor last night and that's what she's referring to. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, can I just have a little bit of your time for two seconds? Why? We're all friends here. What do I, know? I love you all. It's oh, my no. first day on the job, and I don't know how to ask this nicely, okay? Could the smaller people make their way to the front and the taller people at the back just because some people are having some issues? See? That would be great. Thank you so much. Don't now let's go on to the business. Yeah, I like this voice. Oh, I Let really the smaller people voice. see. The following contest is a tag it's team match with a 30 minute time limit scheduled for one fall. Introducing first. That's for the Eve Tag Team Championships. And a big thank you as well, by the way. I missed this earlier, just before. A 9.99 super thanks from Center Force Radio 88.3 DAV Raver. Thank you so much. Making their way to the ring! Sky Switching and Nightshade! A 
Inspiration S A S. Operation Strong and Sexy. Introducing next. So I understand that the reason why Operation Strong and Sexy came out first is it was a case of checking on Lana Austin, just making sure that that knee is as protected as it can be after the attack from the M62 Wrecking Crew. Making their way to the ring! Lana Austin! so loud we can't hear Ivy. Praise the Lord, there is a Jesus. The disciples. Euphoria Wrestling, hi Dan, and good evening all from Germany. Well, thank you very much. Everyone, say hello to Euphoria Wrestling, give them a like, follow them. Share picture next match, no term, all right. Hey, Far5222, two, two, two. great to see you. Thanks for being a champion. Everyone, Far5222, two, two, two. they are on Twitter. Uh, they lost, they had their Twitter account, uh, Twitter being classic Twitter. So if you're not following them, and if you thought you were following them especially, give them a follow on Twitter. I am my good friends, the Gimme A Whole Year podcast followers there, absolute champions that they are. And they're probably streaming a live watch along as well. And wrestling is always best when it's watched with friends. That's what we all are here. We're wrestle friends. That's what we are here. If you like watching wrestling with friends, and you watch wrestling on a Monday or a Wednesday, don't worry. You don't have to watch it alone. You can watch it with friends. And the friends that you can watch it with are those that give me a whole year who live stream their watch alongs. Sometimes on Wednesday nights, I join them as well. So if you're not already giving them a like and a subscribe on YouTube, make sure you do. Give them a follow. They are good people. Well, Ant's a good person. Dom's all right, too. We don't talk about the rest. Oh, except Jack. We like Jack. And we see the need as the Book of Losers. Now, the thing is, the Sky Spitz and Alana Austin are very much best friends. Not quite the best friends that Ivy and... So there's a, <laughs> we, we, if we look at this, it's like last night, Lana Austin got hurt. When it comes to the Tag Team Championships, friends are going to fight. Of course they are, but you, it, it's business, right? You put that aside, at least you tried to, and that's another one's wife is involved, as we have found out previously with Charlie Mulder and Jenna. And you just, you just move on, right? But with Lana Austin and, 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 and Sky, because there's an injury involved, you know it's going to be a little bit more difficult. And that's the bit that, uh, you know, you can't help but be thinking about. Number one, we, we know for certain that Lana Rosta is not 100%. But also, Sky Smithson isn't going to want to seriously hurt their friend. But the Tag Team Championships are involved. Where do you draw that line between Competitive, competitiveness, trying to achieve that, and also your friendship when you're knowing they're coming in hurt. This is a very delicate and difficult situation for all of these wrestlers. <laughs> Solid ring bell work there. Good job. Not quite a solid sentence that followed it, but it was a solid ring bell job there.
Sky Smithson. <laughs> so normally we're really careful about like what camera shots like we go to. This is like the one time where Sky Smithson are kind of wait, what is wait a minute. I missed that. Wait, she's got she's got the book of losers. Sky doesn't want to be in the book of losers. I'm saying okay, she's not in the book of losers. Oh she, no, she's not. Oh, she, mind games? Is this where we, we, we make up for the injury here by playing a little mind games? Okay, 30 minutes on the clock. All championship matches and main events have a 30 minute time limit here in EVE. Sky does like a good swivel. She's got those uh, hypnotic hips, I believe she calls them. know what to say in this situation but offense like the great Arika Tatsumi and Ryusuke Taguchi from far 522 to and again a big thank you to our oh ho, ho. okay that was interesting there because Lana ran all right so ah wait a minute and Sky's bleeding So already we've got some injury going on here because we've got some blood on Sky Smithson. And we've got some, uh, and, the, and the knee injury from last night is playing. See, running is not going to be a good idea. And here's the thing as well. This just happened between the two friends. How much is this going to impact the friendship when one person is now hurting from the injury from last night in the ring with one of their best friends, and the other person is now bleeding as a result of their best friend? A lot going on in this one. Lock there from Nightshade. And Nightshade's obviously got the uh, advantage over Ivy there because she's able to lean that weight in. Oh, closed fist there. And nice. Nice little added there. This is where I think we're really going to see Nightshade and Sky Smithson, who of course won those Eve Tag Team Championships from the Royal Aces last night. Again, we saw Alex Windsor come out and try to start something there as a result of the attack from Charlie Morgan early in the night onto Alex Windsor. Um, I really feel that Nightshade and Sky Smithson are going to really take it to that next level. Oh! Whipped into that corner. Jay tagging in Sky, Operation Strong and Sexy with the advantage. The thing is, if you take out Ivy, really what can Lana Austin do in her current situation? But also, as I said earlier, what are Sky and Nightshade prepared to do? Nice! 
I don't know if uh, Ivy got all of that, but she got enough on a on. A, Lana's asking for the tag, and I was like, I don't think I can. It's not. Beautiful drop kick from Sky Smiths in the height, too! Sometimes you're going to see some moments where, where perhaps the rest are going for the cover. Necessarily isn't going to think they're going to win, but they want to make sure that their opponent has to use some energy to kick out. Sometimes the rest are in the pin, and it's just going to give themselves that extra second of recovery before they get up. And I think that in this match, when we're looking at two teams where a member of each, obviously Lana Austin far more than Sky Smithson, but Sky Smithson is cut, and hopefully that'll stop bleeding because it's at the risk from where I can see it of potentially uh, building up and going into the eye. Uh, oh, this is the second drop kick. And Ivy going for the Boston Crab. That is her finishing hold. She's got it! And you see Sky instantly, she doesn't want to be in that too long. Thankfully, quite early on into, the, into this point in the match, Sky didn't suffer enough to be able to find his own position. Oh my! Like a sheer drop exploder almost there! Yeah, Nightshade not... Nightshade not messing around. Nightshade not long back from training with Chagusa Nagayo, the Eve Hall of Famer, the legend, competing over in Marvelous in Japan. And I'm really seeing the influence. Nice! I don't know if Nightshade got all of that she wanted, but it was a trifecta of moves that almost leads to the finish. Was close. <laughs> oh. Double close one. I think they literally went fist to face there. More than just a clothesline, damn near took each other's face off, and the back of their head smack into that. Went to swear there, stopped myself. Smacked into that canvas. Remember, that canvas is the only thing canvas and a small mat between steel and wood. for sharing it. And if you want to take in the full show, just like the rest of you guys here, it's Lana Austin. Oh, did you see that grimace there from Lana Austin? Because of course she just ran in. She's house of fire. Go. Second glow breaker, an elevated version there. Rolls are a smart thinking. Nightshade a bit late on the save. Lana Austin moves out of the way. Takes Nightshade out. Will we get new tag team champions? Oh my god, what a DDT! Kickstart DDT there. One, two, and no! Oh! Holy shit! Are you are you kidding me? Are you kidding me, Sky Smithson? Are you kidding me, Lana Austin? Slingshot, suit like shades of Tony Blanchard, and oh, no, Nightshade in. Hey, if you're watching the Brain Busters to get your tag team wrestling moves from, hell yeah. Nightshade in now. Keeping hold of Ivy, you notice there. Sending to her own corner. This is what I mean, I really feel that we're gonna see. The best of not, I mean, look, at the end of the day, they've got that tag team championships. And this early into the Operation Strong and Sexy. Imagine how good they're going to get as she leaves her in there. Oh! 
Tag team, beautiful tag team work there. One, two, and Lana Austin runs in, pushes Nightshade, interrupts the count. Great match here. And can we just give credit to Lana Austin for going through this and performing at this level despite the injury? Oh, big spear cuts her in half. One, two, and no. Oh, Lana digs down deep to kick out. Her knee is hurt. The wind has been knocked out of her. The back of the head has been dropped onto that mat repeatedly. And now, Operation SAS going for something here. Nightshade making sure. Oh no, both of the, oh my God. Nightshade going to the top row. Ivy in for the save there. Ivy. Double arm, DDT. Sends Nightshade to the outside. But there's Sky Smitten running knee. Ivy tried the turn. Not enough. Looked like she caught that trigeminal area of the jaw there. Sky Smitson, however, trying to go. No, 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 what strength! Oh, the knee gives out. The knee gives out, and the look on Sky Smitson's face there is one of relief and also concern. There's a big knee, unlike Ivy, Lana, not able to avoid it. This is where Sky knows the desperation. Dream Street. One, two, and it's... What? What a great match, especially under these circumstances. One match, and still, Eve Tag Team Champions! Operation SAS! Championship defense. Remember, we have seen champions lose many times here in EVE on their first title defense. It's almost like there's a curse of the first title defense. Operation Strong and Sexy got past this, and look, Sky Smithson carrying a best friend. One does have to ask this question, yeah? The M62 Wrecking Crew injured Lana Austin after last night. How much do the M62 Wrecking Crew, Alexis Falcon and Lizzie Evo have to answer for the result of this match? If this was an even playing field, would that have gone lost. the same way? The following contest is a singles match with a 15 minute time limit scheduled for one fall. Introducing first. Number one, she's my best friend, Sapphire Reed. I think Sapphire Reed's in the mood for best friends right now. I don't think that Sapphire seems to really appreciate the fact that she's now ranked number two. Sapphire came so close last night. Sapphire came so close last night to becoming a two-time in champion. Right, 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 okay, I can't lie now. I'm starting to get real pissed off. And for those of you who were there last night, know exactly what I'm talking about. I should be standing here in the center of this ring as your new EVE champion. I'm not. I'm not. And for those of you who weren't here last night, let me just give you a quick rundown of what's been going on over here. 
The past year, Nina, the past year, you've made my life absolute hell. She's very angry. You've made my life hell. You've done everything you can to get to me. And last night, last night, that was my final chance. That was my last chance. Can that that belt back around my waist to be your champion? And what? What happened, huh? Someone stuck their nose in where their business didn't belong. Someone got involved when it had nothing to do with them. And you know what? When that bell rang and I lost that match, something switched in my brain and I came to a realization. I came to a realization that all them women back there that I looked up to, they're only in it for themselves. <laughs> They're only in it for them. They never cared about me. I've been here working my ass off this whole fucking time. <laughs> and you know what? Why is it that all them women back there in their mid-30s are suddenly having a midlife crisis, dragging me down, coming out here, partying, getting drunk before their matches, coming out, wiggling about like it's some joke, coming out dressed like zombies, like you're from the fucking walk or dead or some shit. What's going on? What's going on? Because let me tell you something now. I'm not afraid to say it. I'm only 20 years old and I'm one of the best this country has ever fucking seen. So you know what? It's time. It's time for a little change. Let's start doing things my way now, huh? Huh? Dan Reed, where are you, huh? Wherever you are, mate, tonight, when I beat Sue Young, number one contendership for the championship, when I beat her, you're going to add me to that match and it's going to be a triple threat whether you like it or not. So Sue Young, huh? Sue Young, you better watch your ass, because the radioactive one. been pinned or submitted here in EVE and she began her career here in 2019. <laughs> Sapphire Reed wants me to add her to Sue Young versus Nina Samuels which will be taking place at our 14th anniversary show on Friday May the 3rd.
Sapphire is saying earlier that all the people in the back in their mid-30s having a midlife crisis, that kind of cut me a bit, especially because I don't even... I don't even remember my mid-30s. Sapphire. Sapphire getting in the face of Sue Young. Sa Sue singling for that E Championship. Oh, there's no belt there. Sapphire! Sapphire is just a completely different woman. Nina Samuels has completely changed Sapphire Reed. Oh my lord! Nina Samuels has driven Sapphire Reed to madness. Oh my god! The fact that Nina Samuels took everything away from her Sapphire Reed was never able to beat her, not once. Has completely changed Sapphire Reed. They say it only takes one bad day to change someone and drive them to madness. Well, imagine being Sapphire Reed. It wasn't one bad day. It was almost an entire bad year as a result of the torture, the mental torture from Nina Samuels to Sapphire Reed. Now, Nina Samuels doesn't need to worry about Sapphire Reed. Maybe Sapphire Reed, oh, gets hooked. Oh my gosh. Remember, if you are joining us right now, watching the free push on the stream, and you want to watch the entire show, you need to hit that join button and become a member on the EVE Live tier, any EVE Live tier. Oh my goodness. And you will get this show, yesterday's show, April 5th show. You'll get our entire EVE back catalog. You'll get to watch the ex Oh my lord. A split here on Sue Young. Some love her, some not so much. Sapphire Reed, the inter interesting crowd reaction here. We've seen a split crowd here in the past on Sapphire. People were more, people were more behind here a little bit during uh, her sharing her words of wisdom earlier. It's almost like they're like, there, this is what we want to see from her. It's interesting because I'm actually stood around like we're a bunch around. I'm stood around with like a load of very diehard wrestling fans, and they are cheering for Sapphire. Um, on the other side of me, there are some fans here uh, who are not wrestling fans. They're Eve fans. They don't know any other wrestling. They only know Eve, and they are not cheering Sapphire. But the Sapphire fans are definitely drowning, drowning them out. Oh, Brain Buster from the top! Again, you want to watch the entirety of the show. Like, what a great, what a oh, great three matches that we're in. Like, this is only the third match. We've got another four matches to go. Sapphire Reed cannot take away Sue. Oh my goodness. Sapphire Reed cannot take away Sue Young's championship match. But technically, could she force a triple threat? Maybe there's an argument. I couldn't possibly answer that right now. Oh, there's that dirty, disgusting glove. She's going to go for that mandible claw. She's going to go for. Sue Young, never anyone's. Sue Young will never change. 
ducks, catches her on a glancing kick there, just across the, just across the mouth. Oh yeah, that wasn't a wise move to do. Oh, oh, what a move from Sapphire. Sapphire needs to make the most of this opportunity. Remember, Su Young has such an advantage over Sapphire when it comes to experience. And what is she selling up? Oh my god! Nice! Twisting Bulldog DDT there. Spinning sidewalk into like a blue thunder variation to a no! Sapphire Reed, only 20 years old. Look, there is a reason that Sapphire Reed was the first and only person to ever defeat Miyu Yamashita. the greatest EVE champion in EVE history. Oh! Oh, she caused it! I think Su Young was getting prepared to miss Sapphire. The drop kick caused her to spit it out. Wait a minute. Over. Panic switch! No! Sapphire escapes into the octopus. Johnny St. George Kid, be proud. fingers there because she knows she doesn't want that she doesn't want that dirty mandible claw and, and see i'm trying to break it oh but no it backfires but she's awfully close to those ropes can sue get to those ropes and sue you see her reach in there i oh, know the rope foot's on the rope foot's on the rope how long was she in those ropes before, before referee Oscar noticed? <laughs> referee Oscar there checking on both women. Sue realizing the opportunity is right there, potentially for her. Panic switch. This time she's got her after an impact to the head. Oh my God, that is it. Sue Young defeats Sapphire Reed. The winner of this match. The experience. Sue. Retains that number one spot, and the look on Sapphire Reed's face there that she's carried to the back. Su Young gets the win, but here's the thing, right? Let's, let's be real. The experience of Su Young, the experience of Sapphire Reed, like we all know Sapphire's great. But there's two different worlds, or two different worlds, full stop. Two different worlds, though, when it comes to experience levels. And Su Young remains undefeated here in EVE. But Sapphire didn't do herself wrong. She showed, like, she showed up. But maybe her mind is still too focused. I'm glad to hear it. Ladies and gentlemen, it's International Women's Day. Can I get a hop? I was going to say, can I get a I really wanted to do that, but that's going to kill me. Anyway, 
And to celebrate International Women's Day, I just wanted to turn your attention to our gorgeous act tonight. The name of the show is Women Behaving Badly. And this person has been behaving very badly. As you know, I'm not the regular host of this evening. Usually we have a wonderful host, but they called in sick last minute. Yeah, and uh, when I called them, they sounded a little drunk. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the Queen of Neon Burlesque, give it up for Lola Brown! Um, hello? Hello, is this Lolo Brown? Yeah, this is she. You do realise you're supposed to be on stage in five minutes, yeah? Yes, uh, of course. I'm just walking through the door now. Oh, OK. I presume you're arriving in costume then. Uh, yep. Oh, I guess we were worried you'd be passed out somewhere drunk. <laughs> <laughs> Me? No. I don't drink. I got a hangover It's a potentially fatal consequence of Britain's binge drinking culture that has so far gone largely unrecognised. I got a little bit trash last night, night. I got a little bit wasted. I got a little bit mash last night, night. I got a little shit wasted. Well, oh, that was one crazy party. I am hung over. I've got a hangover. 
Who knows what that means? Doesn't that mean you're drunk? No, it means I was drunk yesterday. It means you're an alcoholic. Wrong. You wouldn't come to work home unless you're an alcoholic. Dude, you got a disease. Hmm, hmm. What's your name? Freddie Jones. Hmm, Freddie Jones. Shut up! It doesn't mean you can do what you want. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry I slept with your boyfriend, but I was wasted. I'm sorry I set fire to your dog, but I was wasted. Oh, I'm sorry I blew up planet Earth, but I was wasted. Being wasted doesn't make anything okay. She's the best. Two seconds. The absolute oh, freaking happen. best. Are we ready for the next match? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest is a tag team match with a 20 minute time limit scheduled for one fall. Introducing first. Danny is the best. Ash versus in the chat. Ash is actually just behind me, which is where I like him. How oh, they've come out together? Making their way to the oh, ring. Come out together, okay. They are simple women, not a bad or good shaggy. Shagger and Adonny, and I was like... And introducing their opponents. Alrighty. My question was, which one's the top Shagger? They both told me... Either way to the ring! The Princess Diana of Professional Wrestling! She is fearless! Jenna and Charlie Morgan! The The Royal 
faces now former EVE Tag Team Champions. Lost the titles last night. To Operation Strong and Sexy, who of course we saw successfully retain them earlier tonight. Jenner and Charlie Morgan. It's a hell of an uphill battle here in a way for the tag team of uh, Emerson Jane and Kanji against the Royal Aces. What's also interesting is the fact that we know that Emerson Jane had the most success of her career as a, whenever Jenner was involved, when Jenner was her manager of sorts, her advisor, it wasn't a manager, but certainly an advisor for her. That is when Emerson Jane went on the almost year long uh, reign as Eve champion. Uh, realistically, until Miyu Yamashita, she was the greatest Eve champion in history. Uh, she dethroned Rhea Riley, who at that time was the greatest Eve champion in the history. Then the two traded the Eve championship back and forth just two years ago, three years ago. Can she bring something out of Emerson Jane that makes her, dare I say, likable? Not, not an annoying thing to say. No one knows who... I don't think... I, I think Kanji and Emerson Jane both think they're the top shagger and both think that the other one's the Donny. That is a sentence that I just uh, uttered on a, on a wrestling commentary. Like... Just like my, my life just went before me. I was just... So it's come to this. Oh, what's going on? Uh, okay, bear with us, guys. This was not planned. Listen, nothing ever, everyone's getting their phones out. Listen, it's live. There's no such thing as a mistake when it's live. It was just, um... Hey! I bet you, I will put, I will put 10 pound down right now. I will bet 10 pound down right now, someone unplugged it to put a hairdryer in. a bloody hairdryer, I bet ya. Oh, what? Okay, you know I'm on live comms, I don't really know what you want me to do. It's good, that. Anyway, back to this match. This should be a real good one. This is our final match before the break. So this is your last opportunity, realistically? to become a channel member, right? And watch the show consistently and get the entire thing live. Do you want to see Risa Sarah and the mother of Chaos Casey? That is your main event live tonight. Oh my God, the strength of Emerson Jane there. Remember, who could forget the main event of Wrestle Queendom 1, where Emerson Jane defended the Eve Championship against Charlie Morgan. Who can forget that incredible 20-foot balcony dive from Charlie Morgan onto Emerson Jane as these two, quick as a cat, with the arm drags. Oh! Charlie went for a drop kick. Emerson went for a roundhouse. What a storied history these two have. What a storied history, really, between three of the four. Kanji's the odd one out. The only person... 
Jed is saying, shall I? The crowd replying, you shall not. They don't want to see her in here. <laughs> and because they don't want her to, she will. Lee Inks do, even the lights hate the Royal Aces, right? Oh, it almost was a lights out match there. Jeddah and Kanji. Jeddah, Kanji, one on one. This would have been a match that I'd love to do as a singles, but of course, both are focused on their tag run. run. Uh, same with Kanji and Charlie Morgan. Again, match I'd love to do as a singles, but again, both focused on their tag run. But then look at the incredible tag matches that we've got. Like, look at all four. What's better than two great wrestlers in the ring? Four great wrestlers in the ring in a tag match. What's more wrestlers in the ring, but not as good as two wrestlers in the ring or four wrestlers in the ring? Triple threat match. That's what. The answer to the question on what's good, what's better, is never triple threat. Triple threat never makes things better, just like more championships doesn't make things better. Get back on point, Daniel. Kanji and Jenna. I'm just enjoying the match, to be honest with you. And after the lights out thing, I'm completely thrown out. Hell of a pro, hell of a pro. As Jetta, see, that's where the smartest, that's where you're looking at the experience there of Jetta and, uh, as opposed to Kanji. Jetta knows how to use the ring to her advantage in ways that most people don't because it only comes with experience. It only comes, and that's the injured arm. Remember, that arm was previously broken in a match with Emi Sakura, and then it was re broken shortly after Kanji made her return from that broken arm. And this is the thing about the Royal Aces, right? I mean, you're talking about a real life married couple. They know each other better than anyone else in the world. Until those two, it was Charlie Morgan and Alex Windsor knew each other better than anyone else in the world. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe she doesn't quite know what Charlie Morgan's wrist feels like. I'm hoping it'll dawn on her soon. She's just starting to realize that is a familiar. <laughs> domestic, domestic, domestic. Absolute domestic going on here. Not involved with Top Shagger and Adonis.
too old for this shit. that Jenner is able to do this. A series of suplexes. credit that she deserved when it comes to thinking ahead and also the athleticism and her ability to withstand chops that cause your soul to leave the body. Back. That's the worst. Yeah, that's the worst. That's the worst. Yeah, she's gone. If the soul left that way, it just got put in. Six one nine. I think they just call it six T nine. Oh, that was smart. To the eyes. She had the opportunity to make the tag early when she should. Instead, she tried to keep the advantage going. Jetta was in arm's length of Kanji, and to stop that from happening, just grabbed a hold of the face. Wow! Kanji, but there's Charlie Morgan to take Emerson Jane off and stop there from being a tag. We saw this last night. They are professionals. One, two, no. And remember, 
If you want to watch the entire show, hit that join button right now. This is your last opportunity to watch the full show without interruption. You have seen incredible action. And there is still so much more. Rachel Armstrong, L.A. Taylor, Sashma Martina, Demi Keitel as Kanji and Emerson Jane, Todd Shagger and Adani. On top of Jenna and Charlie Morgan, despite this being their first ever. Emerson Jane. It's a goodery. Code breaker needs her face. One, two, oh! oh. Holy hell! Oh my god! Here is Top Shocker to Donnie did it! Shagger and her Donny. Yeah. Top Shagger and her Donny. That is the thing that happened today on International Women's Day, no less. Wow. We are 
next back here on Friday, April 5th. You've already wrestled once. If you're gonna wrestle one time against each other, I'm gonna make sure it is only one time because otherwise this will never end. So on Friday, April 5th, right here, it'll be Charlie Morgan versus Alex Windsor. There'll be no time limit. There'll be no disqualifications. It'll be a fight to the finish, but I hope you get it all out of your system. Because I said these shows can't happen with both of you here. So, in that match, it is Loser Leaves Eve. And if you think you two are going to do something beforehand and attack one another anymore and ruin the rest of the show, you're wrong. Otherwise, you can both leave Eve before you even get a hold of each other. You want to fight her? You want to fight her? You could do that April 5th. But one of you isn't coming back. Interval, please. Can we play some music and go to interval like we were supposed to? You heard that? It's the interval. Go get yourself a drink. I need one. All right, guys, you got a 20 minute interval. 20 minutes will go up on the screen. Head to that bar, head to the bar outside, go for a piss, grab some drink. We'll see you back in 20 minutes.